All right, guys, I'm here at Bella Vida, and this is the house right here in front of us that's uh, going to be coming available. Eight bedroom house. Uh, looks like it's a great lot, but it's a, it's a, you know, we can't really see much. We'll walk through it in a second. But this house across the street has got a different elevation, but it's the same floor plan, I'm told. So let's go and have a quick walk around this so we get a feel for the floor plan when it's finished. And then we'll see if we can walk across the street and uh, see if we can get ourselves in. So, Eight bedroom, five bathrooms, uh, really well used floor parts, 30, just under 3,300 square feet. So you have a downstairs bedroom, really important for vacation rentals. Uh, we have, this should be an owner's closet here. Uh, sorry, no, it's for, for, for a washer um, uh, closet. So it's a stacking unit that would go in there. And then we would have, uh, let's see here, the garage, which needs to be turned into a games room, which is really quite easy to do. Uh, I like the fact that it's got a nice open high ceiling and a move in my chandelier there. I put some nice uh, artwork. Um, downstairs bathroom. And as we come through, and I haven't been in yet, so there's no lights on. Uh, the granite trace, uh, the tile trace. Uh, whoops, a daisy camera's gone funny. Let me see if I can get us back on here. There we go. Um, needs backsplash tile underneath, which is really easy to do. Peel and stick. Um, some LED lights would re really make it pop. Um, maybe put some pennant light or a light fixture there. Uh, nice big open pan living room. And then if we come to the pool area, um, there's no point really looking at the back of this pool because this house is already sold. Um, so if I look at the other one and see what the view is like and the size of the pool is. Uh, another downstairs uh, bedroom, which is really, really important. This is a true master suite. This is what makes these homes rent so well, if they're furnished correctly. Um, so, uh, great storage space under here. So I'd make this an owner's closet and put a lock on the door. So if you're visiting regularly yourself, then you can leave your own stuff and not have to lug it backwards and forwards. Uh, so yeah, two, two bedrooms downstairs, which is uh, really great. It's, a, it's not the biggest floor plan for eight bedrooms, 3,200 square feet. So they've made really good use of the, of the space. And obviously that's reflected in the price point. So if you can, you can buy an eight bedroom for the price of a six, it's not much bigger than a normal six, but it still has two bedrooms downstairs and a huge den upstairs. It's a, it's a really efficient floor plan. This is going to be a feature and benefit of the house, a movie room or games room, and then we've got a bunch of bedrooms. More closet space. Nice, uh, nice light colours. Lots of natural light with this builder. They, you know, the windows, lots of windows. Um, sort of good angles and little windlets in the showers and you can see you no know, they just they just have lots of natural light um yeah so eight bedrooms um gives you a really good rental potential ceiling uh laundry room up here so you'd have two So I've had eight bedroom homes before, rent well into the hundred thousands and more, 120, 130,000. Um, and my past, I owned and operated uh, a large vacation rental company, which I sold to a, 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 a big organization listed on the NASDAQ Stock Exchange. So apologies if you heard me say that before, I don't sound like a broken record. But for anybody who doesn't know that, um, I'm not just making it up saying, hey, I think this will rent well. I'm only gonna show houses to my buyers who are looking for vacation rentals where you've got the tools you need to then go and put a great furniture package in and that'll give you a great rental. You know, if you have an eight bedroom and you've only got one bedroom downstairs or no bedrooms downstairs, you might struggle. If you've got two downstairs, um, I think you've got the, you've got a real big leg up and advantage. Um, so I would keep that in mind. Let me turn some lights out here and then we are gonna go across the street have a walk through the house and the construction 
which is the one you can buy because this one just sold before I got here. So daylight again here. So somebody beat me to it there, so I slapped my own wrist. And uh, let's go and see the house across the street. And thanks to those guys for letting me to go in. It's still showing active, but the agent told me that they did have an accepted offer yesterday evening. So that was disappointing. But let's go over here to 4475, which that's a couple of months away. So let's go through and see what we find. Maybe there's some builders inside. Uh, so here we go, this is the house. So, yeah. Good for you, looks a good lot. It looks a really good lot. So I won't go upstairs in the building, so, all right. What's up, man? Thank you. Have a good day. So I let the builders build. But yeah, this is available. Ah, give me a call, give me a message on WhatsApp, send me an email, carl at luxuryorlandorealestate.com or my cell phone, 407-705-7634. I'm on WhatsApp. If you'd like me to get your rental estimate of what I think it could produce some rentals, I'd be happy to do that. If you'd like me to put you up in touch with the furniture companies, they'll give you quotes on furniture packages and they'll typically do the whole thing from start to finish, every cup and saucer, every towel. Um, and then the most important one, I think, is the, the rental management company who'll be able to rent it for you. Um, so yeah, hope to speak to you soon, thanks.